Whenever you have an exponent of 0, it results in 1. Here we have 3 squared divided by 3 squared. Well, we might say 3 squared divided by 3 squared. Obviously, that's 1, right? Because anything divided by itself is 1. Let's try our division rule here, since we have the same base. That would be 3 to the 2 minus 2. Since we're dividing, we can subtract the exponents. 2 minus 2, that would give us 3 to the 0. So you see, whenever you divide by something, when you divide something by itself, you're going to end up with a 0 exponent, which, based on what we had here, we know is going to have to equal 1. Let's do some quick practice to make sure you have the hang of it. Here we have 5 to the 0 power. Since it's to the 0 power, that's going to equal 1. Here we've got 4 fifths x squared all to the 0 power. What do you think about that one? You got it. 1. Last up, we have 3 to the 7th banana cheesecake all to the 0 power. Once again, the power of 1. Whenever you have a 0 exponent, no matter what is the base, you always get an answer of 1.